welcome back to my channel. I look super disgusting right now, I know. It is currently at 10.55 p.m. My makeup has smeared. I look like a raccoon. But I'd rather have makeup on in this video rather than not. Excuse me, hold on. Excuse me. So, I did not upload a video I was planning to upload just yet. If you don't know what I'm talking about, it's probably because I haven't uploaded it. Or maybe I have. You guys shall see. I'm probably going to upload this Wednesday. The... Oops, excuse me. I literally have it on October still. Okay. Oh, look at November. It's a little koala. Isn't that such a cute word? Koala. Anyway, I will be uploading it the 13th. Today is the 8th, right? Yes. So, yeah, I will be uploading this video I'm about to show you on the 13th of Win the Wednesday, November 13th. Okay, this is part of what I'm going to show you. So, if you guys can see this big box behind me, I call it big because I've had other orders with not as big of a package as this one. So, you see this big box here from, it doesn't really say, but um, yeah, and this is my Wet and Wild order purchase order there it is right there so i purchased this about a date uh, uh october 26th it's like literally one in the morning and i did use afterpay if you guys don't know what afterpay is let me just give you a quick explanation afterpay is an app you can get on your phone or just go shop at your regular stores you um choose afterpay at checkout for example i did wet and wild your purchase has to be over 35 dollars and um you pay the first payment then and there, and then your total will be divided by four, and you pay every two weeks. So my total, for example, if your total is $40, you pay $10 every two weeks. Well, $10, $10 there the day of purchase, and 10 every two weeks. So you're, you can purchase anywhere from $35 to $1,000. I haven't done that. I haven't even went over like 100 yet. I've been using it for a few months now, and I really like it. It's legit. You don't need a credit score. You don't need any credit. It's not a credit card because it doesn't charge you interest. The only fee you pay is a, a late fee of $8 if you pay late. So you can use your debit card or you can get a prepaid card, whatever, however that works. So I'm just explaining what it is. I have no commission, no profit, no, what's that word? Affiliate. I'm not an affiliate of any kind. I'm just saying it's an awesome app. Shout out to Afterpay. You guys are awesome and you should try it. Okay, back to the box. So here are all my goodies. I got these because when a while I was having like a sale or something, it tells me the price I paid for everything, so that's good. But it's kind of confusing because it just tells you, it doesn't tell you what it is, but it tells you the price. Okay, anyway, so I mean, I know what's in here, but I'm going to just reach in randomly. on top of that okay so the first thing i pulled out was this makeup sponge from wet and wild this holy grail blending sponge flawlessly applies makeup for professional looking finish provides streak free effortless application designed with a unique hydrofolic material to ensure less product waste can be used wet or dry okay um i'm assuming this was 349 or 399 those are the least amount or you know the purchase price was I wouldn't pay more for a sponge than that. So I've yet to try it. All of this is an unboxing because I have not tried any of it and I've waited to film this on camera for you guys. So that is what I'm doing. So, ugh, that bothers me, sorry. Okay, next thing I'm reaching for. Okay, so this is the Wet n Wild Margot Glow Highlighting Palette. This is what it looks like. This is the back. I love how it has the names. It has um, White Lily, Botanic Dream, Blossom Glow, Golden Flower Crown. I'm pretty sure I have Golden Flower Crown. No, I don't. Oops. Oh, wait. I have both. Okay. This one I've been using, Golden Flower Crown. So I already have Golden Flower Crown. The one I have not yet opened, I haven't even opened it yet, is Precious Petals. 
so which is not in here which i thought would be but it's not so i'm glad now i have both i'd rather use up this one before i go to this one i don't know we'll see but these are bomb i should say this one is bomb N not plural because i've only tried it once tried one anyway how am i going to close this okay that's not going to close i have so much makeup and i want more <laughs> as you can tell so anyway I did not pay $10 for this. I got this 50% off. I only paid 5 bucks. Yep. $5. So, this is what it looks like. They're pretty big pan size. Look at that. Like, that's a nice pan size. I've been wanting one. I've been eyeing one since probably last year. You know, it was like 15 bucks at Walgreens. Yeah, that one. This one, basically, yeah. It has a different packaging, though. But I've been wanting this. And I finally saw that it was 5 bucks. I couldn't pass that up. 5 bucks, y'all. Should I do swatches for you guys? Or like for me? Yeah, let's do some swatches. Sorry, I'm trying to watch Blue Buds in the background. Okay. Let me wipe my hand off. This one, I'm not sure if you can tell, but on camera, uh, in person, you can see like a blue icy effect. It seems a little too white toned. Maybe if I mix these two together, I would like it a lot more. But, I mean, I like, out of all of them, I think I like these two the best. This one and that one. So that is my palette, my five dollar highlighting palette. Ooh. So the next thing is I'm gonna, I'm gonna be extra. And put the package, the safety thing back on. This, um, what a wild eyeshadow brush. This was actually free, a free gift. I got just a couple free gifts. If you spent over thirty five or something like that, you got a free gift. I actually don't want to open this. It's really beautiful, and I, I'm dropping everything, bro. Excuse me. Okay. Sorry about that. Okay. Yeah, I totally scratched my leg with this. Oh, well. So, it is a rose. Is that what it's supposed to be? And it has thorns. So, this is the Wet and Wild eyeshadow brush, basically. And I believe it was limited edition. It was in the rose collection. So, that was free. Uh, retail value doesn't say. It just says it was $0. Sorry, I peaked. But to go with the free gift, this was the second free gift. This is a um, what I want color icon eyeshadow quad, limited edition, bed of roses. But do you believe? How does it go? You best believe. I think that's what it goes. You best believe. I'm gonna swatch this. Okay, don't try this at home, kids or adults, because you know me. I shouldn't be doing this either. Two hours later. <laughs> Yo, what is going on? There's literally nothing holding it closed. I mean, the tape is off. <sighs> there we go. Whew. Hallelujah. Okay. I'm tired. Like, that was such a workout, bro. Okay we're back okay so this is called bed of roses this is what it looks like i feel like you get two mattes one semi shimmer and one glitter they're really glittery i'm assuming oh my gosh you guys can't see that can you okay i'm hoping you can see that i'll probably zoom in so burgundy brown semi okay let me explain these two are those two this one is that one and that one basically yeah yeah you guys can understand that right okay cool so now it's this really pigmented i like it pretty good i'm gonna try it out especially for fall Ooh. so yeah free gift didn't pay for it limited edition i'm not sure if it's still available i should make some room for the other swatches coming up but we'll wait on that okay uh i also picked up this brush a flat top brush because I was not at $35 yet and I wanted to get free shipping I thought I don't know something about 40 or 35 so I bought this brush but I've been actually using oh I don't want to pick it up sorry because I have hair uh, I found a new brush what's well, not new I found it in my collection I've been using it for foundation in the past two days and it works bomb similar to this but it's a lot not as wide if you will Sorry, I'm not making sense but you know what I mean next thing I'm peeking excuse me was this wet and wild is this wet and wild 
color icon 32 pan eyeshadow palette i did not pay 15 i paid seven dollars 750 told you 50 percent off so uh from bold shimmery blues and purples to warm matte hues and browns and oranges basically when it says 32 pans how do you think you're gonna fit 32 eyeshadows in here well this is how Ooh, how cute is this they're a little small but it's all right i like them they're really pretty i don't want to swatch this because i have something even better to be swatched so you shall see but i love this these blues that can work so well together and then that purple i mean i'm just so excited like i'm i'm probably gonna use all these bottom shades <laughs> but i want to incorporate some of these like oh that's so cute yes wait can you guys even see i'm all showing you and you guys see a glare hold on excuse me oh come on Sorry about that. So, this is what it looks like. That cute gold. That burgundy is beautiful. Ooh. And then, that does this blue. Okay. Go back to the next one. On to the next one. Okay. I also got this uh, photo focus makeup remover stick. Again, I just wanted it. I was buying random things at this point. It says it's new. Does it have a scent? Yeah, it smells disgusting. Doesn't smell good either. Okay, just so you know. It's not the strongest set, but it don't smell good. Another brush I got, surprisingly, is a large stipple brush. So something I've learned about these kinds of brushes with that kind of head is that they're not as, what would you say? Like, since it's kind of sparse and spread out and not like, full on like this for example this is a wet and wild brush oh no it's not excuse me it's a crown brush what it looks like a wet and wild brush we'll just pretend it is so do you see obviously you can see that this one's a lot has a lot more bristles and this one doesn't i mean this is obvious you guys already know but um i like these i like these i like this for blush because you won't look like a clown you know you can put it on the same amount and not look like a clown versus you guys know what I mean, yeah. So that's why I got this for blush. And then, dang, we're at the best one already? Wow, that was fast. Okay, you guys, don't you just hate it when it, like, sticks to you? Okay, Are you guys ready for this? Cue the music. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. The Wet n' Wild 40 palette. And this is the back, the 40 palette. Limited edition shadow palette featuring 40 richly pigmented shades and buttery soft mattes, rich satins, and gleaming shimmers that let you create your very own gork of art. Okay, before you say this is a dupe for the James Charles, or a copy of the James Charles, personally, I'm not trying to get in anybody's, you know, anybody's business or anything. I personally have not, how do you say this? I'm a Tattoo fan versus a Charles fan, just putting that out there. I don't know much about him. So, if I don't know a person or I don't know, you know what I mean? I won't buy their products, especially if it's $40. Like, I would have bought Jacqueline's palette, would have, but I'm not paying $40. Instead of buying her first palette, where is it? I bought her vault. So, you know, yeah. So, I'm just saying, don't come at me in the comments. We like who we like, we don't like who we don't like okay that being said i paid look at this is the prices i paid so if you don't believe me it's right there 9.99 i paid nine ten dollars for this that's the whole reason why i made this order for this beauty right here this baby right here Ooh. excuse me so i have opened it to peek at it excuse me we're gonna uh cut that out um, I picked out everything, bro. Okay, so I'm actually going to take a wipe and wipe off my arm so I can do some swatches. You know what? I probably do them on the back of my arm. Duh. So it's so much easier for both of us. You know what? But I need to clean my hands off. So, shout out to these wipes right here. Um, This is from Dollar General. Yes, I work there. Okay, I'm trying to save money, yo. This is the Studio Selection 
Night Soothing Makeup Remover Facial Towelettes. Compared to the Neutrogena Makeup Remover Cleansing Towelettes, Night Calming. So, I've used these. I literally... What did I leave on? I literally have three of these on hand right now. I kid you not. So, anyway, um, yeah, these are bomb. You should try them. They're like $3. They're less than $4. I can tell you that. And there are 25 wipes. Side note, I have anxiety. It is what it is. And I'm getting anxious that some people are going to be like being rude or disrespectful about the fact that I don't like James Charles. I mean, you know, it's like if I don't like someone or I'm not interested in someone, I shouldn't be la backlash about it. Plain and simple. But it is what it is, and I, you know? So I'm just explaining how I feel. Everyone has a right to their opinion and a right to feel the way they do. Ooh. No. Don't worry, it's not like ugly and black. That was just the protection cover. This is it right here. You guys ready to see this masterpiece? That's why I know it looks like so and so's palette, but it's not. So it's pretty big. This is my hand with the palette. And then you can tell that. Oh, excuse me. Sorry again with the glare. Oh, okay. There is some, what's it called? What do you call that? Um, fallout. I was like, what is it called? So there is some fallout in the palette. But this is a palette. Look at that beautiful red, dude. Okay, time for swatches. Okay, let's see if, how I'm going to be like one of the YouTubers that I see. Let's do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. I have five fingers, so I'm actually going to do go down. I know it's so weird. I'm going to go down and across, okay? So, start with my thumb. Woo, that's buttery. They're actually very buttery. I'm worried that, not worried, but I have, like, not a, um, that feeling, like, oh, I took the first layer off, which was the best part. So, these are the shades, and then I'm going to... That one's a little, what's it called? Dry, if you will. That one's a shimmer. This one's a black. That's a nice brown. I like this cool tone transition color. So, I know I always ruin everything because I'm obviously going up my arm. But those are some swatches. So, the glim the glimmer, the glitter seems really promising that pink is like ooh for the inner quarter to copy Kylie's look yeah I've done that before I'll post it right here because I tried copying her by the way you should follow me on Instagram okay dang that's that's the thing about pinks and reds they're pigmented and they stain so just an FYI so I'm gonna wipe off my arm I feel like this video is gonna be super long I apologize So the glitter and brown. Oh my gosh, I'm making a mess. This is such a pretty rose. Like, I don't know what you call that color, but it's pretty. Okay, next set of shades. My arm is dry. So, should I go like, like, purple? There we go. That way I'm staying in one place. Ooh, that bronze is so pretty. I love it. A purple is too. See, that's the color I like. Not so much this one. What is that shade? More of a burgundy. Okay. So, second row from top to bottom. That gold is really nice. Like, these two colors alone. Like, that's a perfect look right there. I, with that purple, I feel like it's a retro purple. Like, from back in the day or something. <clears throat> so, just making sure everything's off. Fingers are clean. Um, finger, finger. Ooh. The second to bottom one is more like iridescent. Like, do you see that? It's like different. It's like blue purple. That makes sense. Okay. So here's one. Ooh. Whoa. 
that's a nice red i like this one that purple's cute dang i wish i could like do a rainbow look or something really pretty with all these different colors so that's the third row two three four five five rows to go guys we can hang in there dang it i missed a finger so my thumb is gonna take this one okay those blues are pretty There's that red. It looks different than I expected. I feel like it was more red in the pan. But there it is. That blue like went on forever. Like, ooh, look at that. Okay, so that's the fourth row. Okay, we're almost done. I'm getting kind of like, <laughs> you know? Being a YouTuber is hard. I mean, to be on being honest. Okay. Blue, orange, okay, those, ooh, that one's pretty, okay, that, those hardly showed up, I mean, I could do another swatch, but, you know, on to the next, those are more transition shades, if you will, okay, I'm gonna get a new wipe, because this is, my trash is my things on top of the trash, so I can't throw it, okay, I have a serious question for you guys. Today is November 8th. When should I put Christmas decorations? Is it too soon? Let me know because I have my little Christmas tree up already and I still have Halloween decor. It's a big old mess. So when is it appropriate? I know obviously Black Friday is the first day for me. That's when I would do it. But like, I'm kind of like, mm, maybe a little bit sooner. Okay. Okay, almost done guys. Three more, three more to go. They are pretty buttery. Like, I'm surprised. Like, I'm not even like, oh my god, they're this or that. But they're really buttery. Ooh. Yes, dude. Like, that. Wow. Dang, somebody looks at this. Like, wow. So, those are the shades. This is uh, third from the last row. Okay, this one's really pretty. Ooh, I like this pink. Ooh, that green. I love green. I don't know why, maybe because my eyes are brown, but I love doing. Ooh, that is so frosty. Okay, oh my god, you guys are gonna like laugh at these. Like. Like, I'm even laughing at these swatches. That's kind of pathetic. Sorry, guys. I'm not calling myself pathetic. I'm calling the swatches that word. Anyway, so these are still cute, though. And you can tell there's pigment, and they are buttery. Okay, last row. Perfect white. Some transitions. Beautiful yellow. I love yellows. And then a gold. Gold. Did I see gold, really? This is beautiful. I like green. Oh, if I didn't finish what I was saying earlier, I love greens. Because I feel like they bring out my eyes. Whoa there, buddy. That one's really... What's that word? That yellow, though. The, this was really... This one was really, like, powdery. Kind of gross. But, overall, this is a nice palette. So, let me just wipe this off. The only downfall is that it's bigger than my head. Just saying. So, travel-wise, not a good option. But it's cute. She cute though. <laughs> she cute though. 